Yoo-hoo. It's the time for Becky from China. Sometimes on AliExpress you find these weird, weird products. And this is one of them. So what you can do with this is basically hook up an LCD monitor or an IPS screen or display, how you want to pronounce it, on your PlayStation 4 controller. Yeah, actually it's kind of an ingenious way. So we're going to get different attachments. And with these attachments you can just hook it up with also with your PlayStation 4, PlayStation 3 and also with the Xbox. And with this box, I mean the Xbox One, not the latest version they just released. So this can be said, it is a retro display. Because they are only compatible, as I know of, like for the older models. So what you're going to get inside the box is not a lot. Because you don't need a lot. And portable, it's a little bit difficult to say how you're going to pronounce this. Because what you're going to get actually is like, we're going to get this display. The display itself, Yeah, you hook it up with an adapter on your controller. And you can just play it like this. I think it's just a really cool way to play. So let's grab myself a controller and let's see how it looks and how it plays. And let's forget a console itself. Alright, so let's grab ourselves a controller. What you need to do is slide it over it and you need to click it. And I can tell you this can be a little bit challenging. The plastic feels quite flimsy. Come on. Alright, so when it's in position it feels quite sturdy, as you can see. All right, so the next thing we're going to need are the two little nuts. All right, sorry, I mean the screws itself, because we're going to get two of these. Don't lose them, otherwise you have a big problem. All right, so what you're going to need to do is the following thing. You need to put them in like this. All right, hold it in the right position. All right, be very gentle. Because this is always a little bit tricky the first time, of course. Alright. And of course I forgot to mute my freaking telephone. Oh, it's bleeping in the middle of the video. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it in. Alright, so let's see. Oh man. Don't tighten up too much. Otherwise you get can't get the second one in. Yeah. Alright, so it's a little bit tricky putting it all together. But when you're... Having it both screws in, it works like a charm. All right, so that's it. So what you're going to need to do, you can adjust it. Loosen up the screw itself. Ooh! But as you can see, even when it's not tied up, it works very well. So what you're going to do is tighten it up. And that's the idea behind it. Now you can't move it anymore. Let's loosen it up a little bit. Not too much wicked, not too much. All right, so tighten it up very much. Tighten it up and it's done. And you can play your games. As you can see, you can wiggle it around. It doesn't do anything. So that's very cool. This part works like a charm. All right, let's attach it to the PlayStation 4. Let's put it up and let's see. All right, so the first thing that I did notice with the display, as you can see, it's an IPS screen. It looks beautiful. Okay, but this is really funny because <laughs> don't mind the yellow cable because I realized my controller was just empty. So holding it like this, it's a freaking cable nightmare. Uh, oh, there was one thing I need to point out. I did use this cable, but I realized that uh, there is also a cable that is a little bit thinner. And that normally that came with this kit. So I just need to point it out. So this thing is a little bit big. and But at the end, you're always going to get the thin cables that you're not feeling. But when you're holding it like this, it works like a charm. Man, this display looks really good.
Alright, so let's play a little bit of Mortal Kombat. And now I don't own the newer version. Noop, noop, noop. Let's do a single fight. Oh, it's a long time I've played this game. Okay guys, so this is what you're going to get with the PlayStation 4 portable monitor. So I think this is not really a manufacturer making like the specific um, pieces of hardware for the PlayStation 4. I think the creator or the seller created this, like bought these separate attachments that you get for your, get for your controllers, bought an LCD display, bought a cable and slapped it together like a kit. If this is so, it's pretty genius if you ask me. And overall, it's a pretty cool thing to have if you're having an extra display. Super comfortable. I think that is something to debate about. But let me know in the comments what you think of this idea. I want to thank you for watching. Consider subscribing. Hit that little bell. And I will see you in the next video. <laughs> I drink too much coffee today. See you next time. Bye-bye.